Welcome back, you guys. Today, you might as well call me Arsenal because I'm going to be teaching you guys a lesson. But don't worry, United fans, you can enjoy this one too. It's going to be teaching you how to make coins over Team of the Year, especially how to go from zero to 500k. So if you're new around here, make sure to subscribe. We'll be giving away £200 worth of FIFA points at 12k. But without further ado, let's get into it. If you guys are looking to get some FIFA coins to improve your team and smash through Weekend League, check out U4GM FIFA 23 coins and you can use code RECALL for 5% off at checkout. Make sure to go check out the sponsor, guys. But let's get into the video. Now, before we do get into the video, I am going to open these two packs. We've got a Jumbo Premium and an 88 Mid. Now, the only reason I'm doing the Jumbo Premium is because I do want an Icon Midfielder. Sorry, a Team of the Year Midfielder. And hopefully, we get one which we have not. Pretty trash pack, but we'll take it. Look, I'll be honest, my club is empty as hell. I'm going to need to watch this video after I make it because I'm going to need some coins because my club is dirt. I need to probably open a load of packs through SDCs. I might even end up putting on points. But all I need here is basically one of the top 20, I can't lie. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty uh, stacked in my team, so this could go very wrong. But I'm going to look down, okay? We're going to do an icon roulette, so I'm going to skip it now. I can't see, I can't see, I can't see, I can't see. Send it to the club. It's gone? It's gone. Okay, right. We'll do icon roulette. I'll say, looking at my team, yeah, the main thing I could use is another striker or a big defender. I'll be honest, Alberto's not doing it for me. I don't really like Maldini either. I like him, but not as a pairing with um, Cordoba, who's unbelievable. So oh, why am I even here? Right, we're gonna we're gonna do the icon roulette. Right, I won't show you all of it. I'll be uh, I'll cut it down a bit. No, okay, cool. Um, Brazil, no. So it's getting a bit risky now. Germany, no. Oh, who have we got? Netherlands. So imagine you're on zero coins and you need them first of all. What you can do is go through the consumables in your clubs. When you start the game, you do get free consumables that you can actually quick sell or sell on the coins. So that's gonna build you up to your first K. Now, what do you do when you get there? We're gonna go Gold, Common, Cam, and Premier League. Now, this is just to build yourself maybe 5K, 10K to move on to the next method. It's a simple one. And if you guys already have over a K or 2K, you might wanna skip a little bit further in the video, maybe a minute down, where you'll find the next method. But looking at this, we've got 500 coins um, you've got there. 550, there's a couple pages, not too many. 600 is pretty much what we're going to be going for as a sell-on, so those 400s are brilliant. Now, realistically, if we go to 400 coins, you're not going to be getting every single one, but there is pretty much going to be players coming up every single search. So every search or every other search will get a player. Now, that there, we're selling them on for 600 coins, 30 coin EA uh, tax, so we're making 170 coins off that. That's actually really good, bearing in mind you're only putting in 600 to start. Now, all you've got to do is when you snipe just to be clear for those of you new to it when you search you want to click a as that search wheel comes up so the reason is because as that search wheel comes up if you click a it will action when you see a player so if you click a it should bring up the menu so you can buy it quicker as you can see there and you're going to be able to get the players easier now if you don't do that you might still be able to get a player once you see it but the chances are someone else will be sniping the same players and could have already grabbed them and you see there how quickly players go We've managed to get the prayer though, that is very good. Obviously, you can sell these guys for 550 if you need the coins quicker. So if you are building your club up and you wish to do so, you are able to do that. But let's move on to the next method for when you've built up a bit. So you might be thinking, why am I now on the SPC screen? Marking matchups is one of the big things that's actually changed the market a little bit this week. Usually they don't require two rare golds from the two different clubs, but they have this week, which means Chelsea and Liverpool players are the next players we're gonna look at. So obviously guys, I don't wanna just teach you how to make coins now, I wanna teach you how to find out how to do it in the future and the marking matchups is always a good way so this week you've got premier league liverpool and chelsea who are both required in one of the spcs it slightly rose the players and then that all of them are above or just around the k now obviously at 900 coins you've got two there that are going 950 you've got maybe a couple pages if that but a k is pretty much the mark you're going to want to sell these on for which means the ea tax is 50 coins so we want to go down to about here because then you're going to be making at least 100 coins per snipe or 150 coins per snipe sorry so you go to 850 we're going to keep just sniping down. You can make up to, I think, 300 coins to snipe him. But this is on the basis that you are building up your coins. You're obviously trying to get to 500k there. And the only way you're going to do that is by slowly building up. You're never going to be able to just magic up 500k out of nowhere. So you've got to go through the building process. We've managed to... Oh, we've missed we've missed two 700s there in a row, which would have been the higher level of profit um, you can get on this filter. We'll try and get one before we go on to Chelsea. Oh, 
we've managed to get one there. But as I was saying, obviously, this is how you build an account. You don't just start with a load of coins and you're going to have to build yourself up, up from somewhere. So looking at Chelsea, I think they're a little bit more and um, being that some of the players are just more expensive in a general rule, they are 82s as well. So you're looking at 950 for them um, for the first sort of couple coming up. Um, you're probably going to... I think you could argue a 1.1 sell on, um, but you are probably say for the K, but 1.1 will say, um, so 55 coin EA tax, which means at here you're making, uh, what, 100 and something coins, I think? No, 95 coins, I think this is like 145, roughly. So we'll go to 800. Um, actually, no, we'll go 850, because that's what we were doing before, I'm being dumb. Um, this is clearly the tiredness in my brain catching up because if we're making more on the filler, surely we can get it for the same price. So yeah, Rob, dumb. Um, do not always take my advice and I'll always admit I'm wrong, but uh, I'm, I'm clearly very tired. But we're going to try and get a Chelsea player before we move on. We've missed one there um, and we do want to try and get a couple. Um, but this one will be a little bit harder, I think, because there's more 82s, which means that just a couple people are also going to be selling here trying to get 82s. Uh, Miss a Fafana there, that would have been the top profit of the filter. We'll try, we'll do a 10 count. I don't want to spend too much much time looking at Chelsea players oh that was poor oh we've managed to get one brilliant that was good for me um well not good for me at all but we good that we got it so moving up the budget a little bit gold common striker league one and olympiakos Lionos. now I've definitely said that wrong but I'm terrible at saying things uh, I'm terrible at names so do not punish me for that and um, but you're looking at around 2.5k for these guys now being that they're gold commons you've got a big range of profit on these you can I think sell them for as low as 300 uh, as 50 coins which means you're looking if you get the best snipe at about a 2k profit here now realistically we'll sell on 2.4 EA tax is 120 coins 80 coin profit there 180 there and 280 at 2k so if we can get one that would be brilliant this is one of them filters that's very good in terms of just range of profit you've got per snipe and a lot of people will be getting commons and just be listing them up for the minimum so you've got a good chance there if you just get someone who's a little bit less clued up on the market on FIFA who can list one for you you're going to be absolutely gold and I'd say the prime time to be making coins off this would be reward oh we've missed two we've got one go on center transfer oh wow that was this is gonna be a cheap okay it's fine it wasn't cheaper it wasn't cheaper but we got one i was saying that method was really good for one when you want people to be maybe a bit complacent with what they're listing but for this one you only need a few people to be trying to cut undercut and make a little bit less profit just so they can sell things quicker and that's always going to be happening so looking at this we've got kovacic and we've also got the lovely perisic as well both 84s which is what we love so a filter where they're both the same rated both the same league makes it very easy to make a lot of profit now looking at this you got 4.7 on oh we're not going to get that oh that would have been absolutely brilliant right so realistically actually these might be going for like 5k right now obviously being the sbcs are ruining the market which is brilliant in terms of making profit they're making it so expensive but making it very difficult for me to complete uh sbcs without ruining my entire club so looking at this we are at about 5k ea tax on this is going to be 250 coins 50 coin profit here 150 here and we'll go for 250 because we are ballers oh we missed that that was I don't know how we missed that. That was a pretty solid snipe from me. I'm not going to lie. I feel like that's a bit prejudiced from EA as usual. You know, I'm, I, I, oh, what? No, what? How? No, no, no. There was two. How have we missed? Oh, you snakes. It was a 4.2 we missed. Oh, come on. we got to get one. I've missed. Yes. Right. Okay. Okay. We like that. We like that. We, we got one. I feel like I can probably get another one. I feel like we have the potential to do that. We were doing very well. And you can see if... Oh, that was so dumb. You can see if you've built up the, the, the coins there, you can move up in the levels. So you've gone from basically having no coins all the way up to 5k and on this one where you can make you know up to 2k profit at snipe something you know 3.8 there that would have been about uh 900 coin profit and if you can sell them on quickly if you want to even sell them on for 4.9 you can go in and buy another one straight away and that's how you just build 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 your coins and in between games you can be selling that would have been another really profit we've messed loads of them let's move on to the next fill up for this one it's going to look very familiar but we're going to change something about it we're going to go for min buy now now usually we do this and it's a four or five uh 84 85 rated player you've got Scrinia, you've got Devrige, and you've got Bastoni. So it's a really good filter, and it's under 10k for the, 
for the most part. This one, we're gonna go for the minimum of 10K. You've built your coins up now. You're at maybe 15, 20, 30K, whatever it is you've managed to get to with the other filters. And now we're gonna be looking at this one, which is actually really interesting. I like this filter, the fact that it's just a reverse of what we had before. But if you take off the caps, you can see all the other plays you would get. Now, when you put the cap in, you've got Bastoni, you've got Scrinier, you've got the likes of Dumfries. I think there's another one as well. I might be wrong, but yeah, you've got another Dumfries card there as well. And you've got a Dereege in form. You've actually spoiled for choice on this one. A lot of profit to be made, and especially with Scrinier up right now, you're looking at a very, very similar price for quite a few of these cards. Now, 19.5, 20K for the sell-on of an 86 is insane. But realistically, we're not going to complain. You're looking at 1K EA tax there. So if you go down to 18K, everything is a K profit. If you get any of the other cards, I think any of the special cards show up, you're going to be looking at a little bit more profit um, than you would with a screenier. But either way, a K minimum, very, very, uh, uh, what is it, saturated filter right now in terms of what's being listed, not saturated in terms of who's sitting there and actually spamming out the filter. So there's a few people doing it. There will be other people competing, but not as many as you'd think. And you're going to be absolutely blazing it. With the special special cards especially, I don't think anyone's sniping them. Scrinia may have a bit of heat on him at the minute on the basis that he is 86, but other than that, I reckon you're absolutely good with this filter. Now, obviously, you do have to be lucky enough for people to be listing them. And that, oh, we might have missed one. Oh, I thought we like, we missed a good one there. Right, I'm, I'm hoping we can recover and not have just taking two L's in a row. Right, we'll do a 10 count. I'm going to have to click A. I'm not clicking A. That's the problem. I told you guys at the start of the video, it's really important and um, I'm just not doing it. So uh, that, that's not really ideal. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. Oh, no. No. Oh, right. There's another filter here that I actually noticed was a thing. Um, looking through my club doing these SBCs, which is so upsetting. Um, we've got Premier League, Everton, and Special Defender. Um, I had Coleman and Godfrey who have both exited my club, which is just, you can see how gutted I am when I'm putting those guys away. Like they were they were not bad for crappy teams or or low squad builders, but they just, yeah, it, they had to go. Everything's had to go. Um, we're gonna we're gonna try and recover some coins. Unfortunately, I can't recover my fodder. You're looking at 27K here, uh, about 28, obviously, if we look at EA tax realistically. Um, so 28 for the sell on 1.4 for EA tax. You're, you're making 600 coins here, but at this price, we don't want to only be making 600. So you want to go to about here. You're making 1,100 coins a snipe, I think, per player. You've got Coleman and you've got Godfrey to come up. So both of them pushing this uh, budget up a little bit more, but also both attainable and really easy to build up from the filters we started on with. So you can literally go from zero to 500K with these filters because you build up from zero, you get to your, your 10K, you move on to the next one, you get to your, your 15, 20K filter, you stay on that for a while, then you get to this. Once you're 100K and you're doing this one, you can pick up like four or five cards every few minutes. You're at absolutely golden now that knocking is my dad letting me know that my dinner is ready he's been, he's been a star and cooked for me but uh, i did think i'd get uh, the, the video done before it was ready but i hope you guys have enjoyed make sure to drop a like down below i'm going to enjoy my pie and uh, but you guys can enjoy the videos and subscribe of course that's all i need you guys to do for the giveaway and i'll see you in the next one